So we're back. Got a bad feeling about this. In a long Calm time. Down, Dandelion. What a Siri God, flashback. Wilson Jr.'s hands, you know that. I know, I know, but my gut can't be reasoned with, and no amount of sympathy I feel can silence it, blot it out. Long time no see, Siri. Uh, <laughs> I'll go in alone, you know. I'll go in alone, you know. You'll stay outside. I can't let you go alone. If anything happens to you, Daryl will rip my head off. Probably. Storm secure our retreat. There's bound to be a struggle. Things could get intense. We'll need to flee fast. Disappear in the crowd. Have you learned where Horson is keeping Dudu? Room on the top floor. One with the balcony. I'll need to cross onto the roof. Wait for me in front of Junior's house. And I know it's difficult, but do try to look inconspicuous. If they, <laughs> if they hurt you, Horson will pay. I must climb onto the roof. I'd like to see this pink uh, peacock try and look inconspicuous. <laughs> Let's get onto the roof. Bye, Dandelion. <laughs> there we go. Just like old times. Room on the top floor. One with the balcony. So, quick save. And then we'll see if we can get on the roof where uh, on the balcony of Junior's house. There's the balcony. Let's see what's inside. This is locked. Through the window. There we go. And now, my dear Dodo. Do do. I believe I'll try a different tool. Afraid I'm bored with this one. You're fucking balmy, Junior. Anyone tell you that? No. Most say I'm nice. Once they get to know me. Ah, uh, sincerely. So you enjoy good believe company? that's wrong. Like to make new acquaintances? <laughs> you plan to introduce me to someone interesting? Yep. There you are. Good of you to come. I've been waiting for you. Hmm. You'll regret that. I wonder if Siri can actually parry. treasure? I'll get you, you little ball. Where's Ruvin's treasure? Each time Siri uses a special power, her energy declines. Some energy is stored each time you attack a foe. You will get, regain access to Siri's special abilities once your energy has increased to the required level. So I can't parry like Geralt, but I can of course still teleport. And there we go, that was a quick fight. Ooh, that must have hurt. An eye for an eye. Ooh. He already got a beating. So and that's the house where we found uh, where everything was wiped clean. Those are the tools on the wall. Uh, they're coming. Dudu, no shit, Sherlock. Listen, this is what we'll do. Since Dudu is a Doppler. Okay. Oh, so that's doo doo. And everyone's down! I fucking love playing like Siri. As Siri, I mean. There goes one's head. 
Oh, fuck. So let's try this again. Oh, damn it, it can still hit me. Oh, and that's one of her special powers. And super attacks. That's awesome. So we're starting to see uh, the effects of series Elder Blood. I'm gonna let her health run back. And then we'll deal with the guys on the lower floor. Yes indeed, rumble time. Come over here. Weep. There he goes. I'm back outside. That's what happened. Tell you true. I'm back to Holson. Doo doo. What happened to him? I don't fucking know. Prick vanished. There one moment, gone the next. So yeah. For people who uh, are not yet up to speed, <laughs> which I won't blame you for, we still need to fight Dudu to help us get Dandelion out of prison, who should be able to tell us where Siri is. So, what happened to the ashen-haired woman, Siri? What happened to the woman? Fuck if I know. You wanna get punched again? One of the boys got her in the back, but she's alive, I swear it. Okay. Got anything else to say? I told you all I know. Everything. You hurt the woman I'm looking for. You tortured her friend. She attacked me. I have a right to defend myself. I beg you. Got what I deserved. Have mercy. Please. Well, we've seen what you do with women you get here, so those killings are gonna have to stop. Sorry, Horson. Let me tell you where things stand. I'm looking for this woman, cause she's like a daughter to me. And that's why I just can't let this go. No, no. Yes. Killed by the Emmentaler. As a revenge for all those women you killed. Okay, the camera is being a bit wonky. Hopefully that'll change in a second. We found a few notes as well. Bolton Dubis's notes. Advice to my fellow tradesmen. Never take on a phylactery repair job. Unless, that is, you don't mind sleepless nights. Don't be fooled by the infernal contraption's uncomplicated appearance. I have been struggling with this blasted phylactery for two weeks now. I've used every tool I own, every trick I have ever learned, and I am no pink-cheeked novice, having practiced this trade for a good 30 years. I will next try applying a concentration of chestnut, but I have little hope it will do anything. So that's the, the guy that was trying to fix the phylactery, which should also be around here somewhere. Maybe it yeah, should be over there, so Geralt should already have taken that with him. So let's go downstairs. And get back outside. Is the camera fixed? Yeah, it's fixed, okay. That was weird, it was like pulsating the camera. 
So now we are uh, gonna quickly return to Priscilla and tell us tell her what we uh, found about Dudu. Seems you've resolved your matters. It's time you return the favor. Or not. Benedict doesn't like to wait much, does he? No, he does not. You'll come with us. The so change of plans. Oxenford Tretagor wants the crown jewel of the Redanian fleet. Decommissioned now, though. Nice boat. You'll need to leave your weapons if I'm to let you aboard. Okay, Follow then me. agreed. Told you we we're gonna be on the boat. Ship we're on the boat. With donations from noble women. Ladies from the most prominent families gave up their jewelry. A spur of the moment patriotic impulse. You're a homeless wanderer. Can't understand what it is to truly love one's country. Okay then. I will try to not take that as an insult. Pretty boat though. Hello, Red of Video. There you are. Yes, there I am. Need something from me, Your Majesty? You've never been one to mince words. Very well. Find Philippa Eilhart. That's well, my can't wish. say I'm surprised. I ordered her eyes gouged out once. But apparently her blindness troubles her not. My hunters have detected Lady Eilhart hiding east of Oxenfurt. They have further established that she has magically sealed the entrance to her shelter. Entering it will be difficult. So I Philippa Eilhart is the black-haired so. sorceress that uh, Bring her Dijkstra is in love with. Alive. Okay, that? Why is she here? Philippa Eilhart. What's she looking for here? I suspect she wants to find her old friends. Reconvene the lodge. Perhaps she seeks revenge on me. Yeah, probably. Lady Eilhart is known for her persistence. At times I recall the lessons she gave me when I was a child. Her teachings as memorable as the punishment she meted out. She was subtle and patient in her cruelty. So this is a childhood trauma then. But she remains dangerous. I'd advise you to be cautious. Okay then. Philip is using magic. He'd be better off sending mages after her. I agreed to the Conclave's revival. But what has this brought me? The mages at my side are mediocrities. Cowards. They couldn't hold a candle to the likes of Eilhart, Loantiel, or Merigold. There's always your witch hunters. You are the best witch hunter. You've proven it clearly. She True. Sheila Tanzerville and Philippa Eilhart's plan. You were the one to foil it. I want you to finish what you started. Now go to the mountains and bring me Philippa Eilhart. Okay, we'll see what we can do. Don't know how we'll handle that eventually if we find her, but... We have a new quest, a favor for Radovid. So, I do want to exit the boat. Your arms. My Thanks. arms? Never seen my left one or my right arm. Blade must strike true, no? It's a matter of the hand, not the steel it's holding. That was a friendly compliment. But we were going to uh, head back to Novigrad to inform Priscilla. There should be a fast travel point around here over there. So see you in Novigrad. So back in Novigrad at the uh, Golden Sturgeon. Uh, the Kingfisher. The Kingfisher. Did I always say the Golden Sturgeon? Apparently this is the Kingfisher. The Golden Sturgeon is another in. Sorry for that uh, again, mistake. Really yep, back again. Hello Priscilla. Think I know how to free Dandelion. Got a plan. But we need Dudu. Gotta find him. This plan? What is it? Our Doppler friend will assume Menga's form. Order Dandelion move to Oxenfurt. We can grab him on the way. Brilliant. But how do you aim to find Dudu? You're his friend. Any idea She's where sarcastic. He might be with a Doppler, the question's never where, but as whom? 
In the past, facing trouble, he'd disappear, then reappear on the morrow with someone else. But this time, this time he hasn't returned. Okay, then how long have you known him? Known Dudu Long. I know this might sound strange, but I can't be sure. It seems he'd been circling me for some time in various forms, trying to attract my attention. Can't blame him for making the effort. Thank you. I failed to that notice was a first. compliment out of nowhere. Then he decided to shoot the moon, assumed dandelion's form. What tipped you off? How do you know it wasn't dandelion? Due to not much of a singer. No. He simply spoke about something other than himself. <laughs> we need to Poor dandelion. to reveal himself. Any friends we could leave a message with someone he trusts. Dandelion? Irina Reynard's troop, that's all really. Not certain he was friendly with anyone else. Spent dawn till dusk with the troop, on stage or in the crowd. So he liked going to the mummings? Yes. I'm actually surprised he didn't come to us after it all happened. He certainly could have counted on the Foxen's help. Hmm. So if these mummers are ready to help... We need only mention Dudu. Irina and company are deeply in debt to him. Okay then, then we have our goal. Dudu and the mummers, how they meet. That was my doing. Some opening night. Maxim lay comatose in his wardrobe, drunk as a notter. I thought of Dudu. Hard to imagine a better actor than a doctor. And Dudu revealed himself True. to them just like that. I didn't think it wise to tell anyone. But Dudu and Irina took to each other completely and right away. He fell so hopelessly in love with the theatre. That he started performing with you. Yeah. Now Irina feels terribly guilty. They let him put himself in danger. She can't forgive herself. It's not her fault, though. So maybe a play's the thing, you know? Maybe we could use a play. You know, work a message to do you into something. Lure him out of hiding that way. Not a bad idea. But I doubt a few lines would suffice. Besides, do you really think Doodoo -doo whiles away his days attending mummings he knows by heart? So what do you suggest? We must write an entire new play. From scratch. Something grand. Something that will grab Doodoo's attention. So most importantly, it must have a splendid title. It must be the talk of the town. If you wish, we can start on it right away. Hmm. I'm gonna hold off on that for a second because I'm gonna take a little break. I've been uh, recording for quite a while now, so let's write later. We'll write the thing later. Good. I'll have more time to prepare. You may wish to speak to Madame Marina and her troop first. You'll find them in the butcher's yard of the main market square. Be back soon. See ya. Yeah, thank you for your help, Priscilla. So, I uh, hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, don't forget to like it right here on YouTube. And for more, just don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Thank you guys enormously for watching. And I hope to see you in the next video, where we are going to write a play. Good times. Goodbye.